with Yanni Caracas. The high school spring championship season rolled on tonight. Division I boys lacrosse serving as the headliner. The LaSalle Rams looking to keep their dynasty going. Rams looking to run their championship string to five in a row. Rams four straight titles tying East Greenwich's D2 run from 2011 to 2015. Moses Brown did their best to keep the Rams offense in check, but ultimately LaSalle makes it five straight, 7-1, the final over the Quakers. Our senior leadership was great this year, captains included, and um, we were just able to do it for one another. We were a very unselfish team. Whoever was hot that day was uh, going to do it for us, and um, you know, it never gets better. I would tell you this, without getting emotional, because it's really difficult, this is a great group of kids. It's um, <laughs> this usually isn't my style, but um, it's hard to talk about. They're just this wonderful group of 37 young men. Great Gatorade bath. D1 baseball decisive one for Hendrickson and LaSalle. Hawks jump out to an early lead. Pass ball allows Matt Sweeney to go from second to third. Then a second one gives Hendrickson the 1-0 lead after Sweeney slides in safely. Later in the inning, Andrew Hopgood finds some green in shallow right field. Another run in for the Hawks. They win 5-0, advancing over the Rams. When Socket and Warwick Vets D2 semifinals in softball over at Rick, this was a great game. Vets down three in the final inning. Caitlin Fallon rips a ball in the left field that gets past the outfielder and clear the bases for the Hurricanes. We are tied at seven. To extra innings we go when Socket back up a run. Two on, Holly Latorno gets extension, drives this ball out for a three-run shot to right. When Socket wins a thriller, 11-7 is the final. The rest